I'm down to two apples and one banana. So, banana, same banana. I need to go to the store today just to like pick up um, some like household products. Let me bring y'all around here. Just like pick up some household products like um tissue. I think everything else I kind of got tissue and I want to see if I can find some more reasonable cleaning supplies. So I'm gonna do that. I'll probably get like some more fruit like some bananas and some pears i was watching um what is her name what is her name lovely tv oh jesus i feel like i'm saying it so wrong i feel like i'm screwing it up lovely tv ladies lovely tv something like that. i know i'm screwing it up miss lovely tv i was watching her and she was talking about um Aldi's how Aldi's has some really inexpensive fruit and they do so I may end up going to let me come in front of the sun y'all I feel like I I don't know what that is in my face I promise y'all I shower today but I may go by there just to get like some fruits because she reminded me they do have some pretty reasonable fruits get like some watermelon and maybe some cantaloupe yes so I'm gonna do that I'm probably gonna go by there but it'll be later on this afternoon and i want to still try to get my orders done so we gonna get it done today you guys my whole computer no time out but i'm gonna take a quick break enjoy my breakfast <laughs> enjoy my breakfast and yeah you guys enjoy y'all thirst okay make sure y'all enjoy y'all thirst <laughs> slowly turning bad and i'm trying to stay on the positive side so i got out because i'm gonna try to make this quick it is 6 15 so i got out because well, i was already gonna do grocery orders but i was waiting to get an order and so i got out um before i even got my grocery order i text my landlord this long message just telling him like hey you know my light bill is x y and z i'm not going to close the entire amount you guys but i told you it's over 400 so I'm telling my light bus X, Y, Z. I'm telling him about the usage of my light, like the, the what it says the usage is and what is it called? K, K, W, H is like, what brand I'm talking, baby. It's like what the average is and what um, for a regular home and for a home that's my size. And it's like what the average is for a, um, what's it called? Energy efficient home. And it's like mines. So like the regular home and energy, I forgot how much of the energy efficient was, but I think like regular home was like a couple of hundred. I think it was like, yeah, I can't remember. Ho hold on, I'm about to tell you the exact amount. Okay, y'all, so it's like 932 for a regular home. That's how many, uh, I think it's called kilowatts. I, I could be wrong. That's how many it is for a regular home that's my size. Um, like far as in square footage, they're comparing the square footage and the size of my um, mobile home. Y'all, so that's 900 for average. Mine's is 3,000 and something. Mine's is 3,122. So, y'all, okay. So, anywho, so it's, so my thing is I shouldn't have to pay an over $400 light bill and be still hot in my house. I mean, and still be hot. I should be comfortable. So, my house is 81. And I guess why I'm irritated now is because now the kids room, at first it was just my room that was kind of warm. Well, not warm, my room was hot. It was my room that was hot, but y'all know I had the fan going. And then now it's the kids room. Now their room is starting to get hot. I have tried blackout curtains. I've tried blackout curtains, you guys. I took, I recently took the blackout curtains down because for, for me, 
um being in a dark room being in a dark area that makes me like that bothers me it bothers my spirit i don't know i y'all may be like Brittany, you tripping but i promise y'all when i'm in a dark room or a dark space i get sad all of a sudden like it's like it gives you this like you just i, I don't know i don't want to say i get depressed because you know that's such a strong word and you know you know what i'm saying but it's just it puts me in such a bad down space so I was like, no, I can't do the dark. I can't do the blackout curtains. But before I got the blackout curtains, you guys, my light bill was high. Put a black up curtains, had those up for a while. Light bill still high. Took them down, got different curtains up now. Light bill still high. So uh, it's part of my house is not installated well. And that's the only thing I can gather from it. So I sent them a long message, you know, just something like I'm, I'm not about to be paying over $4 in a light bill and be uncomfortable. Now, I'm going to be straight out honest with y'all. The rent in the city that i live in is so high so i can't just afford to up and move either is like it's like i don't have the option to just get up and say oh i'm just running another three bedroom place like i ain't gonna lie to you i don't have that i don't i don't have six, 16 17 dollars to kick out to uh, another place you know what i'm saying so it's like i'm trying to make it do what i do what i can do with the house that i have so um after i text him that or whatever um i was just like i'm gonna go get some fans for the kids room sorry my story is all over the place you guys because their rooms is starting to get hot and yeah like hot to where dante is like sweating and y'all know my baby i always wear sweatshirt so if it's hot to him i said dante brandy so if it's hot to him then and he of his sleeping <laughs> but if it's hot to him you guys then that's major because he always got a dog on sweatshirt so um and brandy room is warm brandy room is a little bit cooler than my room and dante room and i guess because me and dante room is on the end and the air unit is not cool the window unit is not cool in our rooms and the air that's coming out the vent is blowing out good but it's like the top of my mobile home, i don't know if the top of the mobile home shifted or it's not insulated or what but i've been going through this you guys for the past like at least three summers and each summer i'm telling him He's trying to come up with stuff to fix it. So I'm not going to say he ain't been trying to fix it and try to figure it out. He has been, but lately it's just, it's not a priority on his list. And I guess I get it because his house is cool, and but my house is not, y'all. And I can't do this. I can't, so I'm going to get fans. But in the process of me getting in my car, I noticed one of these lights earlier. And so I'm like, Dante, you know, is my tire flat on that side? He said, it looks normal. So I looked on my side, my tire wasn't flat, but I get these three lights. So, I don't know a whole lot about cars. So, I send it to my boyfriend or whatever. And he's just like, one of them is for my brakes. And the other, I think he said two ones for my brakes. And if I'm putting on your Crocs, mama, put on your Crocs. You're not wearing those. I know. We about to get out, mommy. We go in this store. We come right back out. Um, He was like, one of them is for my brakes. I think two of them for my brakes. And the other one is for the tire pressure. So he's at work right now. So he was like, well, um, just add air in it and then I'll take care of it. I'll take a look at it. And then as far as in like my brakes where he's like, I'll just do your brakes for you. Or, you know, if there's any issues, he'll get them done. So I think my car is driving normal, but now I don't want to take the chance of doing any, any orders, grocery orders, because I don't want to screw up my car even more than what it screwed up. So, and I, like I say, I don't know much about cars. So when I leave big lights, cause I'm at big lights already. So when I leave Big Lots, we're going to go ahead to the gas station. And once we um, put air in the tire, I'm going to see if these lights go off. If they go off, then I'm going to try to do some orders. If they don't, then I'm going to just take my butt to the house. And until he's off tomorrow, he can kind of figure out what's going on if I can't get the turn off. But just want to give you an update of my day. It was going good. And then all of a sudden, now the bottom is trying to fall out, you guys. And I'm trying to stay positive. I hate coming up here having to complain and whine to you guys. And I'm trying to come up with solutions when i was low on cash i was like okay cool bam i'm getting a second job i'm gonna start working so it's like i'm trying to come up with solutions because i hate whining about a problem and not trying to fix this not trying to come up with a solution so i'm hoping these fans will like cool off the room so maybe they just need to circulate the air some in the room or something like that so it's worth the try so we gonna head on into bit lights okay y'all and then i like a whole bum up here <laughs> bum out here y'all it's too hot to take my hair down. What is that, baby? It fell off my sandal. You broke your sandal already, mama? It fell off. <sighs> okay, I'll fix it. If I can't fix it, your grandma, she fixed stuff like that. Come on, watch out. Oh. Come on, Brandy, go, mommy. It's hot out here, baby. You're not hot. Why are you running out of the car? Come on, Boogie. Boogie, pass me two masks in there. You're passing two masks out of that box. Come on, mommy. 
I don't even have no place to prop y'all up. Girl, I'll just put shoes on. Yeah, I searched online. Oh shoot. I searched online and the cheapest place for fans was Bit Locks. Huh? Yeah, they got the fans right here at the front. This is the one I want to get for $20. You can get the mini fan. Okay, now say the box is not big. We just gotta figure out how to put it together. Yeah, you no, that's a small one. It's right there. That's a small one. They got this one. That's 34. You, so you rather have that one or I thought the black one because the black one is high up off the ground. It's up to you. Let me see how much this one is. How much is this one, I say? What's the paper say for that one? See a paper for that one? A yes, ma'am. That's a fan. Mm -hmm. Do it say how much that, that one is? For each of no? our rooms. Okay. But well, now I'm going to just get y'all the time because I feel like that'll give y'all more, more air. And then put them in a the buggy, baby. I'm looking to see if I can find like any little, um, I'm looking to see if I can find any more snacks for the kids. I'm letting them pick them out some snacks as well. I was looking for some juice for them, but I don't see any. I'm probably gonna pick up a $5 pizza tonight. Huh? Yeah, go ahead. You want, you said, can you get some what now? Oh yeah, go ahead. Um, I wasn't cooked tonight, you guys, but it's so hot. So I'm gonna just, Brandon, start there, cause you copy your bread all the time. So being that it's so hot, you guys, I'm not gonna turn the oven on or the stove. I'm gonna get a $5 pizza for the kiddos. Come on, let's go this way. Y'all got the buggy, come on, come on, mama. Oh, Lord, these kids right here. This, we ain't gonna make this stuff too long. I see, baby. I'm looking at the seasons that he got for $119. Oh, they got garlic powder. Oh, this $1. Oh, I got garlic salt, y'all. I don't have garlic powder. And I can't use the garlic salt. Chop onion. We got some of that at the house, mama. They got some of everything. They even got basil. Watch out, baby girl. What's the sodium like on this? Sodium kind of high on it. No salt seasoning. I got gravy, baby. This. The sodium is. Got tacos. No, I don't need taco mix, mommy. Okay, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna try this no salt seasoning. And I'm gonna get some garlic powder. Hi, right, but we can go to the next side. Huh? Dang. Yeah, go that way. I'm about to go behind you, though, baby. I'll be behind you. You about to turn around? Okay, that's fine. Um, come on, mama. Come on, give me a hand. Because you and your brother can't seem to stay together and not argue to save y'all lives. I think we got spaghetti sauce. Go away, squeeze my hand. Brandy, don't make me hurt you. These are really good, but God, oh, that ain't that But those are really good, though. Um, I think that's it, y'all. I'm looking. Oh, I got some of these at the house. I wouldn't mind making tonight, but we ain't even going there, y'all. I'll probably make those tomorrow. Well, you want the trail mix, too? Right here. <laughs> Me, too. You don't like these? They good. I like them. Oh, watch your Takis boogie. I'm going to get them, y'all, since me and Dante eat them. Uh huh. All right, yeah, that's it, boogie. Y'all, we all look bad. Don't judge us in the comments, okay? Because oh. you want to put your Takis separate, baby, which I understand. You don't want your brother to be going back and forth about who Takis is who. Um, Brandon, stop doing that, mommy. Why did you do that? Anywho, y'all, we wasn't planning on getting out of the car. It was just gonna be a quick run inside until I found out I had the um 
get fans. Okay. Come on, Brandon. I'm about to let y'all attempt. I mean, if I'm about to let y'all watch me attempt to put these fans together. Um, sorry y'all about my emotional outburst earlier. I don't want to be that channel that always has something negative going on. I'm just expressing myself. And yeah, um, we did find a gas station. With an um, air pump. So I, I had driving like three or four one class, but I did put air in my tire. The air pump that I was at, they wouldn't let you put no more than 32, whatever the air thing is called, 32 things in your air, 32, I guess, pressure of air. But my car requires 35, so I just stopped it at 32. And I text my boyfriend, and I'm just like, uh, listen, I'm gonna need these instructions. I put 32 in there. The light still is the lights is still on. So yeah, he's like, babe, don't scratch yourself. I got it. I handle it. But I'm a grown adult, so I'll be trying to handle these issues on my own, guys. He's a sweetheart, but I hate depending on people. Okay, let's figure out how this go, y'all. It's supposed to come off? Oh, to loosen. I'm going the wrong way. Go on. Brandy, back my camera up, Mommy. What? Oh, Lord, y'all. Yeah, first of all, I'm being fast. Hot, Going to finish So, yeah, y'all. Sorry about my outbursts. I'm, I'm emotional right now. <laughs> okay, let's see. All right, step one, open this. Bam, I got step one. Mama, get over there and eat that pizza, baby. Cause you've been doing the most all day now. Get over there and eat that pizza. All right, step two. Let's see. Pizza. 
this quick because y'all already seen this stuff but trail mix the kids them both got their takis fruity pebbles just got a giant box of them y'all this didn't even have the price on it i'm hoping it was three dollars um and i did end up getting my two seasonings because i am going to cook tomorrow once it cools i don't know how i'm definitely going to do some cooking so yeah that's all i got from big lots i'm about to eat me something i got a piece of burger left over from earlier today so I think I'm going to eat that and I don't think I want no pizza. I'm going to go ahead and end off this vlog here, you guys. It's just been a day. <laughs> it's been a day. So I'm going to go ahead and end it off here. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I need to straighten up this kitchen. I mean, this living room. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Sorry if it felt like it was all over the place. Um, I love you guys. I'm pretty sure it's probably going to be a short vlog, but I love you guys. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. And yeah, I will see y'all in the next one. Once again, sorry for my little mental breakdown. Um, just a status update though. I text my landlord at 5.40 p.m. and it is now... Brady, turn the TV down! It is now 7.44 and I have not heard anything from him. So I'm guessing maybe he's at work. Um, I wanna put a voiceover in here really quick just to let you guys know 
he did end up responding like around nine, a little after nine, stating that he was at work and that he's going to have somebody come out tomorrow along with him. Um, so they will be here at nine in the morning to take a look at everything. He said that it's somebody who apparently went through the same thing I'm going through. So I will keep you guys posted. Um, I don't know. But that was two hours ago that I texted him and still no response as to what to do about my ear. So, yeah. Um, that's it, y'all. I love you guys, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, y'all.